We're back now on Today in AZ with our ongoing coverage of the class of 2021. Team 12's Tram Mai sat down with Valley School superintendents and officials to discuss our new normal when it comes to school this year. Meet Dr. Chad Geston, superintendent of the Phoenix Union High School District, Dr. Betsy Hargrove, superintendent of the Avondale Elementary School District, Michelle Campuzano, board member of the Roosevelt School District, and Michelle Cabanillas, lead social worker for the Roosevelt School District. All their students have been virtually learning since the start of the school year. How has that been going for your districts? It is uh, the most difficult launch of the school year I've ever experienced. We've committed to being in all remote learning for at least the first quarter. That does require that we get laptops or devices in some form of hotspot uh, to every single child that needs one. It also requires that um, teachers are trained to be really good virtual teachers. Um, requires that parents uh, have the skills and the time and the ability to help their child navigate. Chad talked about having uh, parent involvement. We have far more parent involvement than we've probably ever had relative to an ongoing conversation, communication. Um, not only do they know what's happening with their children in the classroom, often they're in the classroom. We're worried about screen time. How do you get all of that content that kids normally spend six to eight hours in a school to get in a two hour block because that's what's recommended for screen time. And then how do you get packets so they can do their work off the screen so it's not then an additional two hours of screen time. The social, emotional, physical, mental toll during this time, what is it that everyone is going through? And depending on our circumstances, we're dealing with a lot of different things. The loss of people that we love, people that are sick, loss of jobs. Chad, let's go back to you. What is working and what is not working? What's working is we have been able to distribute uh, enough devices to every single student in our system. We've been able to train all of our teachers on multiple software platforms. What's not working, that there are technology glitches. Uh, sometimes they're our issues, sometimes it's Microsoft, it's Zoom, it's Teams, and so, right? so you've, you've got these constant um, glitches. Uh, that's lost learning time, that's stress. Too many of our veteran teachers that have taught for 20 to 30 years say that they feel like a first year teacher. Um, and, and, and at the same time, their, their own children are running across the background and right, they're having to navigate at the same time. And so that's a huge challenge. This is tough on parents. For parents to have to balance their kids, their own learning, their own employment, their own bills, their own stress. Um, all of that weighs on the social emotional wellness and ultimately impacts learning. Our coverage of the class of 2021 doesn't stop there. If you know about a school story we should cover or a concern we should investigate, just email us at connect at 12news.com.